Our fourth tissue type in the human body is nervous tissue. Nervous tissue is very unique. Nervous tissue is, is um, designed to allow us to transmit impulses, transmit information, and um, this requires some very specialized cells in order to do this. The main cell types that are involved in nervous tissue are the neurons. A neuron is a very specialized cell. Um, what it does is it sends electrical impulses, receives and sends electrical impulses. And what do we mean by an electrical impulse? We'll be coming back to this later on in the course, but essentially this just means ions move. So ions moving across the cell membrane allow these cells to send signals, basically. In order to do this, the cells have to have three major components. Um, and we can just point to this picture down below in order to see them. What we're looking at here, this purpley thing that looks like it's got spider legs, this is one cell. This is called a neuron. And right here, this section that I'm kind of circling, this is the main cell body. We can see the nucleus right here. And um, coming off of this cell body, we have other projections. There's one up here, there's one over here, uh, some down here. So these projections are the things that allow signals to be received and sent by this cell. In general, neurons have a lot of dendrites, and these are smaller projections. These are projections that carry signals towards the cell body. So this would be how the cell would receive information, is through those dendrites. And then there's one, usually one longer um, projection, and that's called an axon. This is the branch that allows the cell to send information. So receive information through dendrites, send information through the axon. And we'll be getting into this in a lot more detail when we talk about the nervous system later in the semester. Uh, you'll also notice in this picture, there are a lot of little dark spots in, in the nearby vicinity. These are actually cells also. These are much smaller cells and they are present in order to help the neuron do its job. These smaller cells are called glial cells and their whole purpose is to protect the neuron, provide it with nutrients that it needs, and just help it be able to do its job. So neurons and glial cells together make up nervous tissue.